in the tank is an ancient food with modern health benefits. Hi Sharks, how you doing? My name's Kadimo. I'm the founder of Mama O's Premium Kimchi based out of New York City. And to the left of me is a living legend. My mom, Mama O. Hi Sharks. Hi. <laughs> Along with my beautiful and very pregnant wife, Amy, who could not be here today, we are the owner operators of Mama O's Premium Kimchi. We are seeking $250,000 for a 10% equity stake. So sharks, everyone knows kimchi is delicious, but did you also know it's super nutritious? Kimchi is an Asian superfood from Korea. It is naturally fermented and is full of probiotics. That's right, kimchi is health food, but more importantly, it tastes incredible, and not just with Korean food either. Kimchi goes great with hamburgers, hot dogs, mac and cheese, the list goes on. What makes our kimchi the best is our authentic Korean mom recipe, <laughs> kept fresher than other brands by our innovative packaging. In addition, we invented the first and most complete homemade kimchi kit. What used to take over three hours, now you can do in less than 10 minutes because all the grinding, mixing, measuring, juicing, chopping and shopping is already in the jar. Just like my mom used to make, and it comes out perfect, every time. It's a lot easier than you think. So Sharks, who's interested in fermenting some money while augmenting your tummy with Mama O's Premium Kimchi? <laughs> nice. Good job, All I right. love kimchi. Damon, if you wouldn't mind, as a fellow New Yorker, would yes. you help Mama O make some kimchi on stage using our kit? Absolutely, it will be an honor. Hi, Damon. Today, you're going to turn this Mama O's Premium Kimchi Kit to Mama O's Premium Kimchi. It's like sex education, but spicier. <laughs> <laughs> Please put on this rubber glove. Thank you. You normally need rubber gloves during sex education. For kimchi, you start with a head of Napa cabbage called pachu in Korean. Pachu? <laughs> All right. I've already cut one and and brined overnight. Next, add one jar of kimchi paste. Scoop it out with your fingers as much as you can take out. Okay, <laughs> that's enough. That's it, okay. That's enough. Now let's mix. Just gently toss it. Gently, tenderly, <laughs> lovingly. I'm getting turned on, Damon. <laughs> that's it. It's ready for fermentation. It is, but okay. some of us enjoy just made fresh kimchi and eat it like salad. Oh, that's sweet. Grandma? Uh -huh. <laughs> now, we put it in the kimchi uh, jar and it looks like this. So what is this right here? This is an airlock that okay. makes your kimchi breathe while it's fermenting. That's so amazing, thank you. I feel so warm and fuzzy now. Aww. David, first of all, thank you. Sharks, uh, you have a sample of what we're offering. We have four different kimchis, the kimchi paste and the uh, kimchi hot sauce, which I didn't even mention in the pitch yet. I thought it was only just one type. Actually, there are hundreds of types of kimchi. Okay. But the one that most people know and familiar with are Napa cabbage. We have the original, a vegan version, Ooh. a mild version. Did the you try spicy. the super spicy? Oh. That I was about to warn you about the super spicy. spicy. Like, Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. It's really hot. <laughs> I want to know about you guys. Like, how did you come up with this idea? I needed some kimchi for myself, and uh, I live in New York. My folks live in Maryland, so it's too far to go to Maryland to bum a jar. So I would bring it back in this exact cooler, our family cooler, and back then, I would wheel it home on my skateboard. Wow. <laughs> so I asked my mom to teach me how to make it. And then I was buying some ribs, and the butcher's like, oh, you eat with, that, with some kimchi and rice, eating like a king. So I said to him, you know, I sell this stuff. I didn't. <laughs> and he said, I want to start carrying it. <laughs> now we are nationwide through Whole Foods. We Whole just Foods. got wow. into... How much does it cost to make, and how much do you sell it for? It costs us $2.65 to make a bag of kimchi, and it retails from $8.99 and up. 
And the kimchi kit, uh, we make them for $8.25, and we wholesale for $20. So tell us about your sales. Our top line sales for last year was $815,000. Wow, nice, that's good. Okay. job. And what will sales be this year? This year, we are projecting a million dollars. And how much will you make? 25%. Good for you. And is the majority of your sales right now coming through Whole Foods or is it direct to consumer? We do almost zero online sales. We have our own website, but really? that's that's not our focus. But we also uh, partner with William Sonoma. Have you been in there a long time? Probably about eight years now. So why are your sales higher? Uh, I built this company for $50 and a skateboard. So building it up, I have zero outside investors. I've done everything so myself. Let me re-ask the question, because you've got the distribution, so what's holding you back from being a two, three, five million dollar company? Because I always thought the way that businesses work is you 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 make money in the business and then you can hire more people instead of getting any well, outside Well, you are making funding. money. I'm assuming you pay yourself, or is that part of the 250? So uh, I don't pay myself. I've invested the money back into the business. Got it. So Okay, First that makes of all, sense. you started this with $50 in a skateboard. I'm a mom, I have sons. How does this make you feel, Mama O, to see your son build something like this? I am proud of him, but more than anything, I'm thankful that he is an honest, hardworking entrepreneur yes. who is passionate about kimchi. He single-handedly run the kimchi business. Now, two years ago, he met Amy and got married. They're expecting their first baby next month. And Amy has lots of experience in food business. She quit her well-paying job and joined our company. So now, we are a dream team at the cusp of fantastic growth. So, with your backing, the sky is the limit. Oh, I that's really that beautiful. So much. Honestly, it is beautiful. you can't bring mom like that's un that's unfair. You have a million in sales. You know, I look at it and say to myself, you have to educate people about what this is. And I think over time, as people become much more concerned about healthy foods, this yeah. is going to fit in that category. The hardest job of this is actually getting people to try it. It's not for me, guys. I'm sorry. I'm out. You hey guys, one of the hardest things an entrepreneur has to do is determine when to add their first employee because you have to give up a little bit of control when you try to go for growth like that. But after eight or nine years, there had to have been an opportunity for you to do this. I just don't think you're gonna be confident and I think it's gonna be hard for an investor to work with you. So for those reasons, I'm out. As much as I love you both, and as much as I love kimchi, and I think it's really spot on for the future, it's just not investable for me, and I'm sorry, I'm out. Thank you. Your story was so inspiring, and Mama O, you are one of a kind, truly. But if I'm gonna invest in something, I gotta be able to like really stand behind it and sell it, and I'm not a kimchi person. For that reason, I just can't invest in out. Damon, you're the last shark. Uh, tough one because I, I, you've sold a good amount over the years, but why do you feel that you're ready to change the way you've been operating with your family? Mm -hmm. Why is this the time? We're, we're expecting a baby next month, so that's another mouth to feed. Uh... Sharks, please, if I may say something. Mama O's kimchi company needs money for capital investment and expanding our That's facility and all that. That's why you came to Shark Mama right. But not only money, but your expertise, your direction, your guidance, your support. I would like to have someone to come in and teach us and then lead us to the big market. That's why we are here. Well. I'm on the fence, and I think it's really because of Mamo. She, she's definitely just amazing. I'm gonna have to trust, uh, I think, my gut. I'm not obsessed with the product. I'm just obsessed with the culture you and Mama O, and I, I hope I don't regret it. No, you know what, I hope I do regret it, but unfortunately, I'm out. Good luck, guys. Thank you for this uh, opportunity to swim with the sharks. <laughs> Good luck. Congrats. Do I think the Sharks made a mistake today? Absolutely. Well, the important thing is that we stay healthy and love each other. 100%. That's the most important thing.